All right, guys, minute till class starts. If you've been in class, I'm sorry, you're gonna hear it again. My name is Abby, six o'clock burn. Hopefully you're in the right place. Um, I just sent the playlist in the chat. So if you don't have it, it's right there for you. You can copy and paste it uh, instead of clicking directly from the link. And then for class today, just a set of weights. I have, Gab and I have two sitting next to us. It's just two different um, weight sizes, but you only need one for class today if you'd like any at all. And then just a reminder, Classes for tomorrow will be sent out either after this class, if they haven't been sent out already, it kind of depends on based on dinner time. So with that, let's just see here. Still have like a couple seconds, last minute people trickling in. Um, grab a sip of water. Any questions, comments, or concerns, feel free to shoot me or Yoga Fit Studios a message, email, whatever. I love to have feedback for well, not only class, but just kind of how this whole Zoom thing's going. So I believe it is six o'clock. So let's go ahead and get started. I have the playlist on pause right now. I'll let you know when to start that. So to start out class today, let's begin an extended child's pose, bringing our knees open wide, fingertips to the top of your mat, just beginning to find your breath, inhaling deep through your nose. Exhale, let it go. Inhale through your nose, fill up. Expanding the rib cage, exhale, let it go. Continuing to use your breath and only here at your mat during this time, but throughout class today is a way to guide you and to push you, to strengthen you, pushing your body past fatigue. Your mind will give out much faster than your body will. You know what you are capable of. So I encourage you to push your mind to do one more set, one more round, like I know you can. On your next inhale, bring a slight rock to your head, side to side, massage out the space between your brows, begin to release any tension that you may be feeling. Maybe lifting your hips slightly off your heels. On an exhale, sinking your hips a little bit closer to your heels, stretching out. Inhale, little lift of the hips. Exhale, sink it down. Inhale, walk your fingertips a little bit closer to the top of your mat. Feel the stretch between your shoulder blades. Begin to widen out. Inhale, little lift of the heels. Exhale, sink it down. Let's take two more rounds of breath. Inhale, lift. Exhale, sink. On this last breath, I encourage you to set an intention for class. Maybe flipping your palms towards the sky if that feels good. Drawing anything you'd like to use as a motivation, as a way to guide you and to push you for the next 55 minutes. Something that needs a little extra love, a little positivity, maybe it's just you yourself. You've carved out 60 minutes. I encourage you to use it to benefit yourself, to benefit your mind and your body. So whatever that motivation is for you, that person, that place, that feeling, Take a big inhale through your nose. Think long and hard about it. Hold it at the top. And on your exhale, send it out. Let it go. Take any last little movements, any relaxation you need for four. We'll start our music in three. Rising to a tabletop in two. Pressing play in one. Rising up to a tabletop position. Begin to find some organic movement, moving side to side, forward and back. Maybe you've been sitting all day working or studying whatever you have been doing. Allow this to feel good. Letting your neck roll a little forward, gently, maybe moving it a little back. Maybe flipping your wrist and facing your side and flipping your palms. Wherever you are, meet me in a neutral tabletop position, stacking your shoulders over your wrists, your hips over your knees, tucking your core in tight, straight line from the crown of your head to your hips. Take a big inhale, drop your belly, lift your gaze, cow pose. On your exhale, we round our spine, creating space between our shoulders, cat pose. Inhale, drop your belly, lift your gaze. Keeping that chin high, exhale, let it go, round that spine. Pushing into the mat, active movement here. Inhale, drop your belly, lift your gaze. Exhale, let it go. Moving vertebrae by vertebrae. Take two more rounds, cat and couch your own breath. Here we go. 
Let this feel good. Let each movement be a little bit bigger, stretching a little bit farther, especially that cat pose, really pushing into the mat, opening the blades. Take one more round of cat and cow. Here we go. Exhale, let it go. On your next inhale, drop down, neutral tabletop position. Finding your core once more, realigning your body, flipping your toes, lifting your knees two inches off the mat. We hold. Rock forward and back. Just forward and back. Forward and back. Here we go for four, four, three. Down dog in two. And one, flipping your hips up high. Down dog, pedal it out. Again, letting this feel good, bringing your hips wider, your feet farther apart, a little bit closer together, whatever you need. Maybe shaking your head, shaking it, no. On your inhale, lift your right leg high. Exhale, bend the knee, roll it out. Moving your hips, moving your foot, moving your ankle. If you're moving it right, circle it left as well. Really allowing for the full movement here. Inhale, fly that leg high. Exhale, knee to nose, pull it in. Inhale, fly high. Exhale, knee to right elbow. Inhale, fly high. Exhale, knee left elbow, cross it over. We hold for four, four, three, fly high in two. And one, fly high. Exhale, let it go, draw it all the way through, low lunge. Dropping your knee, lifting your chest. Rolling your shoulders down your back, option to fly your arms high. Otherwise, keep them directly on your knee, keeping them in line with the ankle. Wherever you are, inhale, fly those arms high. Exhale, grabbing your left wrist, draw it over, side body stretch. Inhale, little lift. Exhale, sink. Inhale, lift. Exhale, sink. Inhale, come back to center, planting your hands on the mat, flipping your knee off the mat. We're in a low lunge. Active movement here, We're moving from a bent leg to a straight leg. We bend and straight, bend and straight. Stretch out the back of the leg. For four, four, three, down dog in two. And one, stepping that right foot back down, dog pedal it out. For four, left side in three, in two, in one, inhale, fly that left leg high, exhale, bend the knee, roll it out. Moving it left, moving it right, feeling the cracks leave the body. Remembering to breathe. Inhale, fly that left leg high, Exhale, draw it through, knee to nose. Inhale, fly high. Exhale, knee left elbow. Inhale, fly high. Exhale, knee right up. We hold for our foot. Four, three, we fly in two. And one, inhale, fly high. Exhale, join it all the way through. Use your core, drop your knee, lift your chest. Same options apply here to fly those arms high. Option to keep them on your knee, stretching out the right side here. Wherever you are, meet me flying those arms high, grabbing your right wrist this time. Inhale, lift, exhale, sinking towards that bent leg. Inhale, lift, exhale, sink. Inhale, lift, exhale, sink. Inhale, come back to center. Exhale, dropping your hands to your mat, flipping your knee off the mat, active movement here. We bend and straight, bend and straight. For four. Four, three, down dog in two. And one, stepping it back. Take any movements you need here to feel finished, warmed up, ready to go. For eight, for seven, stretch for six. You've got five, high plank in four, in three, in two. Mimi, high plank in one, walk it on out. Option, have your weights under your palms like Gab does there, protecting your wrists a little bit more. Feet are hip distance apart. We hold, we tuck our core under, straight line from the crown of our head to our hips, our hips to our heels. Inhale, breathe, exhale, let it go. 
Inhale, breathe. Exhale, let it go. Moving to elbow tracers. Inhale, draw that right leg in. Lower to the wrist. Lift to the elbow. Step back, right side. We in, lower, lift, step back. In, lower, lift. Draw in, we lower, lift. Try to maintain connection all the way through. Use your core to lift your body, activating the lower abs. For four, for three, left in two, and one, left side. Here we go. It's in, it's lower. We lift, step back, in, lower, lift, step back, lower, lift, in, lower, lift, count down. For eight, it's seven, you got six. For five, so good. Hold in four, in three, high plank in two, and one, high plank cold. Step back. Readjusting your, readjusting your feet. Option to walk them a little farther out. Better stability, otherwise draw them a little bit closer. A little bit more of a balance challenge. Double knee taps, here we go. We lower and lift, lower and lift, lower and lift. Slow and control is the name of the game. Lower and lift. Count it down, here we go. For four, it's three. Pulse low in two, pulse low in one. Bending those legs, we pulse, we pulse. Pulse so good, feel that burn. For four, four, three, high plank in two, one, high plank hold, here we are. We hold for four, four, three, side plank in two, and one, opening to the right side, weight is in our left hand, coming down to your knee, we have a side crunch. Lining it up here, stacking your hips on top of each other, lifting our right leg off the mat, drawing our elbow to our knee. Here we go. We crunch, extend, crunch, extend. Feeling your body move in a little bit to add that added crunch. Keeping that leg lifted if you can. Yes, you can. For eight, seven, crunch for six, five. Hold out in four, in three. Hold out in two, hold out in one. Pulse it up, here we go. Pulse, pulse, pulse. Squeeze your core. For eight, seven, left in six, five, left side, four, in three, left in two, one, switch it out, left side. Going right into it, start the crunch, here we go. Crunch, extend, crunch. Remembering to breathe. Crunch, extend, here we go, it's eight. Seven, it's six. For five, we pulse in four, four, three. Pulse in two. One, pulse it up, here we go, it's pulse, pulse, squeeze, obliques. You got eight, seven, six, five, release in four, three, release in two, and one, shake it out, grab a sip of water. All right, moving on from our plank combination here, often to grab a set of weights, meet me at the top of your mat. Moving on to some squats. Starting with a basic squat, warming up those legs, lower and lift for two, here we go. It's lower, for two, lift, for two, lower, two, lift. Really think about pushing those hips forward at the top, keeping your knees over the ankles. Option to bring your feet a little bit wider, better stability. Bringing them a little bit narrow is gonna add that challenge. Finishing our warm up. Here we go. It's four, three, two, 
One, coming to that low squat. If your feet are hip distance apart or further than hip distance apart, walk them back in. Hip distance apart, pop that right heel. Lower, lift halfway. Lower, lift halfway. Lower and lift. For eight, seven. Can you get lower for six? For five, we pulse low in four and three. Here we are, it's two. Pulse low in one with that heel popped. Remembering to breathe, tuck the core under, it's like tuck the hips. Little lower count, eight, seven, left in six, five, you've got four, three, left side, two, one, left side. We lower, halfway lift, lower, halfway, lower, squeeze, lower, squeeze, squeeze those glutes, squeeze those thighs, lower and lift, lower and lift. For eight, it's seven, here we go, it's six. For five, pulse in four. You've got three, here we are, it's two. Pulse low in one, pulse, pulse, pulse. Feel that burn, can you get lower? Push yourself here, I know you can do this. Eight, seven, here for six, five, you've got four, three, walking your feet out in two, one, coming to that low squat, walking your feet six inches out, popping that right heel, lower, halfway lift, lower, halfway, lower, halfway. Really think about shooting energy through the ball bounce of the right foot here. It is not a dead foot. We're sending energy all the way through. Thigh is fully activated for eight. Here we go for seven. You've got six. Smiling for five. Here for four. We pulse in three. Yes, you can in two. Pulse low in one. Pulse it down. Pulse down. Little lower. Feel the difference. Count it down. It's eight, seven, six, five, left in four, three, left in two, and one, lifting that right heel, halfway, lower, halfway lift, lower, and lift, feel that burn. Eight, seven, you've got six, five, here we are, it's four, you've guessed it in three, we're pulsing in two, and one, pulse up, pulse, 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 pulse. Option to slow the pulse down, option to speed it up a bit, up tempo. Can you get lower? For eight, seven, six, five, wider in four, three, wider in two, and one, walking our feet out even farther now. We are in a wide squat. We're lifting our right heel again this time. We lower, halfway lift, lower, halfway. Can you get lower to lift? Lower and lift. Booty all the way to the ground. Here we go. It's lower and lift. Lower and lift. For eight. For seven. How many? Six. You've got five. So good for four. It's three. Pulse in two. Pulse in one. Pulse it low, find that low squat. Energy's all the way through the legs and the booty back, chest is lifted. Pulse, 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 pulse. For eight, seven, six, five, left in four, three, left in two, and one left side. We lower and lift, lower and lift. So good, it's lower and lift, lower and lift for eight, Seven, squeeze for six, for five, pulse in four, in three, pulse in two, one, pulse in low, pulse, 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 pulse. Little lower for eight, seven, six, five, froggies four, three, froggies two, 
And one, going right in from that wide squat. Drop it all the way down. Digging those elbows into your knees. Option to bring them to the mat. We lift and lower. Lift and lower. Lift and lower. If you have your weights and you want to add a bicep curl at the top, option to go no weights. Add that bicep curl. A little bit of extra movement. You can do this. Yes, you can. For eight, seven, you've got six. For five, four, four, three, hold low in two, hold low in one. Hold that low froggy squat. Lifting up two inches. Activate the glutes, squeeze the core. Lift two inches. Remembering your breath. Four, three, froggies two, last round. Here we go, it's lift, it's low, it's lift. It's so, so good for eight, for seven, feel that burn, for six, for five, hold low in four, in three, hold low in two, hold low in one. One more round, those lifts, here we go. Lift two inches, hold, squeeze and squeeze. Lift two more inches, so good, so good. Just hold for four. Three, release in two, and one, release it down. Take a quad stretch, so good. Grab a sip of water. Meet me on your mat, doing a little bit of shoulder work on our belly this time, laying flat down, bringing your arms out in front of you, starting with just some Superman, starting to activate the posterior side of our body, lifting your legs and your arms at the same time, here we go. We lift and lower. Superman and lower. Option just do one. If you're doing one, I encourage you to plant the tops of your feet into the mat, lifting only your upper body. We're squeezing our glutes, we're squeezing our arms. Lift and lower. For eight, it's seven, so good. Six, five, here for four, hold up in three, in two, and one, lifting your chest high, extending your arm straight out in front of you. Swim it out, swim it out. For four, three, relax in two, and one, set it down, bringing your right ear to the mat. Take a two deep breaths, inhaling through your nose. Exhale out your mouth. Inhale through your nose. Exhale out your mouth. On your next inhale, start your Superman's V. Lift and lower. Lift and lower. Squeeze and lower. Squeeze. I encourage you to hold just a second at the top. Feel everything come together. Lift and lower. Gaze is to the edge of your mat. Lift and lower. For eight, seven. Here for six, five. You got four. Three, swim it out, in two, one, hold and swim, swim, swim. I'm sure our pool's gonna sound pretty good after this. Here we go. Four, three, release in two, and one, dropping your left ear to the mat this time. Take two breaths, inhale through your nose. Exhale out your mouth, inhale through your nose. Exhale out your mouth, big Inhale, as you lift, pressing the tops of your feet into the mat, lifting just your upper body, lifting, coming down to a lat pull, extend and lower, four power. Lift, pull, press and lower, lift, press. As you pull down, really think about squeezing the shoulder blades together here, holding at the back, extend and down. Lift, pull, extend, and down. If this is too much, come up, sitting up tall on the top of your mat. Pull and lift. Pull and lift. Count it down. It's four, three, two, one. Bringing your body to the lower, lowering your body all the way down, bringing your arms to a T this time. Keeping your chest lower. 
Drum in, extend. In, extend. Count it down. It's eight, seven, six, five, four, three. Coming to a W and two. One, W to a T. W, T. V, T, V, T. Feel free to drop your forehead to the mat. Pure shoulder right here. V, T, so good. Eight, seven, here for six, five, you got four, three. Release it two. One, shake it out, coming up to your knees. Coming up to a pike position. Feet are head distance apart or slightly farther. Pike position, here we go, shoulder push-ups. Lower and lift, lower and lift. For eight, seven, you've got six, five, four, three, Pike in two, one, coming up to that pike position, rotating your shoulders to graze your rib cage. You've got a little bit of tricep here. Lower and lift, lower and lift. Same exact thing, but elbows are grazing the rib cage for eight, seven, you've got six, five, alternate in four, three, Alternate in two, one, shoulder to tricep. Shoulder, tricep, shoulder, tricep. Keeping the gaze of your eyes between your legs. Lower, lift, lower, and lift. For eight, seven, six, five. Here for a four, three, hold that pike. In two, one, hold that pike position. Stretch it out a little bit for four. One more round of those in three. In two, and one, here we go. Shoulder, tricep, shoulder, tricep. Count it down. Eight, seven, you've got six. Five, burn those shoulders. For four, four, three, come into your knees in two, and one, drop to your knees, bringing your weights on either side, stretch it out. Grab a sip of water, bringing your weights either side if you have them, starting up on our knees. Palms are facing, facing the camera, I suppose. Basic bicep curl, halfway. Lift, halfway. Lower, lift, lower, half. Lower, lift. If you still need a little bit more, sit back about four inches, activate the core here. Lift, halfway. Count it down, four, eight. It's seven. You've got six. Come halfway, five. And four. We come halfway in three, in two, halfway in one. Open, close, open and close, open and close. Push, open to push. Create resistance by squeezing the biceps rather than act passively moving through. Open, press. Like a magnetic field between those weights. Eight, seven, You've got six, five, here for four, three, wide arms in two, and one. We lower, full range, come halfway. Lower, lift, lower, halfway. Eight, seven, six, Five. Yes, you can. It's four, three, halfway in two, come halfway in one. 
bringing your weight slightly above the elbows, less than 90 degrees. Extend, draw in. Try to get those elbows to touch at the back. Extend and pull. Remembering your breath for eight, for seven, six, four, five, four, three. Here for two. Dropping those weights in one. Bringing those weights down. Find your push up pose. Finding that plank pose, bringing your hands slightly wider than your shoulders. Option to stay here for your push-ups. Challenge though, to bring your right foot on top of your left. Single leg push-ups. We've got 12 here. Yes, you can. Here we go. It's 12. It's 11. You've got 10. Option to come to your knees at any time. It's nine. Here for eight. Seven. You've got six. For five. Switch in four. And three. Switch in two, and one, dropping your right foot, bringing your left, here we go, it's 12, it's 11, yes you can, it's 10, single digits, nine, here for eight, so good for seven, it's six, you've got five, it's four, it's three, count it down in two, drop in one, dropping those knees down, grabbing your weights. Bringing your palms facing each other. Hammer curls, here we go. It's lift, lower, halfway, lower. For eight, seven, you've got six, five. Here for four, three. Come halfway in two, come halfway in one. Holding halfway, just pulse, pulse, pulse. Plus, for eight, seven, six, five, four, three, with a push, and one. Hammer, curl, and push. Lower it down. Curl, press, lower it down. Eight, it's seven. Here for six. You got five. So good for four, four, three, it's two, release in one. Here we go, shake it out. Coming to a lunge position, bringing your weights with you is totally an option. Finding that lunge pulse, drawing your right foot forward, left foot back, each in its own lane. Find that lunge pose as we hold here. Rather than doing a basic lunge, we launch and lower, lift and lower, lift and lower, squeeze for eight, seven, you've got six, so good for five, curtsy lunge in four, cross it over in three, in two, curtsy in one, drawing it to the opposite side of your mat, lower and lift. Lower and lift for eight, for seven, for six, for five, four, three, pulse in two, and one. Pulse for eight, seven, six, five, other side, three, two, one. Switch it right out, going right into it. Lift and lower, lift and lower, controlling yourself on the way down, eccentric movement, lower and lift. For eight, for seven, you've got six, curtsy in five, so good for four, push yourself for three, we curtsy in two, and one, curtsy lunge, lower and lift. For eight, for seven, for six, Five, so good, so good for a four. Pulse in three, in two, and one. Last little push here, eight, seven, six, five, release in four, three, release in two, and one. Drop your weights, grab a sip of water. 
Before we go into cardio, stretch it out. Moving into a ladder today, going up but not having to come down, I promise. You've got two movements, between, alternating between a burpee and mountain climbers. Burpee, mountain climbers. Right and left equals one movement. So we'll go two to 10. So you'll go two burpees, two sets of mountain climbers. We'll have a little break between. Then we'll do four burpees, four sets of mountain climbers, right, left, right, left, right, left, right, left. Six, eight, 10. That'll be it for the ladder. And we'll finish it up with a little bit of extra at the end. So between, feel free to jump your ropes up side to side. You'll have a four to eight counts between each one. So jump your rope here for four. Four, three, whatever we do, we keep moving for two. We have our first set of two in one. Here we go, two burpees. Take any variations you need. Yes, you can. Two burpees. Come all the way up, come down. Mountain climbers, right, left, right, left, right, left. Jump your rope. <laughs> Jump your rope. Here we go for eight, seven, six, five. We have our set of four and three. In two, and one, here we go, four burpees. Yes, you can, push yourself all the way, adding the jump, taking out the jump, stepping back, that's three, that's four. Coming all the way up, coming down, mountain climbers. Using your core, how fast can you go? When you are done, we jump that rope. We're almost halfway there, not so bad, I promise. You're here for eight, for seven, six, for five, here for four, three, two, you've got six, and one, six burpees, here we go. Yes, you can, push yourself. I'd be running around right now if I could. Here we are. Think that's four, that's five, that's six. Yes, you can, here we go. Coming all the way up to go all the way down. Right, left, that's one, that's three. Strengthening your core, getting that heart pumping. All right, over halfway, we're over the hump. For eight, seven, here for six, it's five. You have a round of eight and four and three. We have our set of eight and two and one. Here we go, that's eight, that's seven. Yes, you can, it's six. Here we go, that's five, that's four. Burpees at your own time, it's your own pace. I'm counting gaps. That's one, mountain climbers. Yes, you can, here we go, here we go, here we go. As fast as you can, challenge yourself, push yourself. It's only 16 minutes and you're over halfway done. One more rung in this ladder, then we're all done with burpees, I promise, promise, promise. Rest for eight, four, seven, you've got six. It's our last round in 10, in four, in three, a round of 10 in two. Here we go, in one, that's 10, that's nine. Be the best version of yourself here, yes you can. You are so strong. Feeling that burn, feeling that burn, here we go. Finish strong, finish strong, finish with mountain climbers and step it out. Here we go, here we go, here we go. A little faster, a little faster. Wherever you are, finish strong with those mountain climbers, no matter what count you were at, walk it out. You're all done. Give yourself a pat on the back and grab some water, keeping your head above your heart. That was hard. So, great, great work. Wherever you are, we're gonna keep moving on, bringing your feet hip distance apart, heels facing each other, like in a first position if you've ever taken a bar class. Doing a little bit of heel lifts. Option to have your weights. We lift and lower. Just a lift and lower. Lift and lower. So good. Lift and lower. Lift and lower. Remember to inhale through your nose. Exhale out your mouth. Active recovery. For eight, seven. Squeeze those calves for six. For five. We're here for four, four, three, come halfway, in two, one, halfway, pulse, pulse it out. Pulse, 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 pulse. 
for those caps. For eight, seven, six, five, hold in four, three, hold in two, and one, hold halfway. Squeeze your glutes, tuck your hips under. Arms can be out, your hips are out of side from you. We lift, come halfway. Lift, come halfway, top half. Lift, halfway, lift, halfway. Eight, seven, for six. So good for five. We're feeling strong for four. Full range in three. In two, one, full range drops. Here we go, it's lower and lift. Lower and lift for eight, for seven. You've got six, for five, pulse in four, in three, we pulse in two, one, halfway pulse. Here we go, pulse, 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 pulse. Hopefully feeling that burn. For eight, seven, six, five, top half, in four, in three, in two, and one, here we go. Full range, half, lift, half. All the way up, halfway down. All the way up, halfway down. For eight, for seven. We've got six. For five, hold up in four, hold high in three, hold high in two, and one, coming high, bringing your arms out aside from you, little circles. Going forward or back, we'll eventually switch it around so it does not matter. Squeezing those shoulder blades together for eight, for seven, reverse in six, in five, reverse in four, in three, reverse in two, and one, reverse. For eight, seven, six, five, four, three, release in two. And one, dropping your weight, shake it out. We are on our mats for the rest of class. Good news there. Coming all the way down, find a tabletop. Actually grab your weights first. Doing a little bit of glute work, sitting on our heels like we do for our arms. Sitting back all the way down on your heels, just lift and lower. Lift and lower. Lower and lift. Squeeze those glutes. For eight, for seven, you've got six. Here for five, halfway four. Four, three, two, come halfway in one. We lower halfway up, lower and lift halfway, lower and lift. Working those legs a little bit more, lower and lift, lower, squeeze, lower and squeeze. For eight, for seven, for six. Here for five, for four, you've got three. Full range in two, full range in one. Here we go. It's lower and lift, lower and lift. Eight, seven, you've got six. For five, smiling for four, we're almost there. And three. Yes, you can in two. We do those halfway lifts in one. Here we go. Lower and lift. Half and lift. Lower, squeeze. Lower and squeeze. For eight. For seven. So good, for six. For five. Release in four. In three. For two. And one, release those weights down. Find me to tabletop pose. Squeezing your core in tight, tucking your hips under. Extend the right leg long, lift it up and lower. We lift and lower. Squeeze and lower. For eight, 
for seven. You've got six, five, cross over, four, and three. Moving to crossovers in two, and one. Add it to a crossover. Lift, crossing the other side of your mat. Cross and lift. Really activating the outside of your glute here. Lower and lift. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three. Fire hydrants in two, one. Fire hydrants. Lift, lower, lift. Remembering your breath. Eight. Seven, here for six, five, hold in four, three, hold high in two, one, holding that leg high, flexing the foot, extend to draw in, extend to draw. Little bit of core work here, a little bit of balance. If you really want to test your balance here, extend the left arm in front of you and extend. Eight, four, seven, four, six, here for five, other side in four, three, other side in two, one, drawing that right leg down, lifting the left leg high, lift and lower, lift and lower. Count it down, it's eight, seven, You've got six, five, here we go, it's four, it's three, cross over, one, cross it over, cross, lift, drawing your toes towards your right side, really using the glute to lift the leg rather than momentum, lift and lower, lift, lower, eight, seven, six, five, here for four, three, fire hydrants, one, here we go, lift, lower, squeeze, squeeze. Think about activating that inner thigh as you draw it in, strengthening the outside, but also the inside. Eight, seven, here for six, five, hold high in, four, Three, hold it high. Two, one, extend it long. Extend, draw in. Again, option to find a balance challenge in here. Balance challenge here. Option to extend your right arm long in front of you, even if it's for just one or two. See where that balances out. See where your core is. Try and keeping your hips in line, core tight. Lots to think about. Eight. Seven, six, five, almost there. It's four, it's three. On your back in two, and one, drop it down. Following onto your back, moving onto our core sequence here. Finding your crunch pose, bringing your feet out into a butterfly, drawing your elbows to your knees, Halfway bar, crunch it out. Lift and lower, lift and lower. Bringing your elbows to try to touch your knees, not your knees coming to your elbows. You will feel a difference. Lift and lower, lift and lower. Keeping that lower back connected to the mat. Eight, seven, you've got six for five. So good for four, three, around the world in two, and one, planting your feet around the world. As we crunch, we make a circle with our abs. Come long, circle it out, come long. We are moving each abdominal muscle one at a time as one crunches, one is extending. The slower you move, the harder this will be. You should feel it pretty quickly here. Roll it out, bring it down. Exhale, 
Inhale on the way down. Exhale on the way up. Exhale on the way down. For eight, seven, six, five. Reverse in four. In three. We reverse in two. And one. Reverse that circle. Here we go. Lift and lower. Lift. Lower. Around we go. Exhale to inhale. Cores engage. Feeling stronger. Eight, seven, six, five. Cherry pickers four. In three, legs up the wall in two. And one, drawing your legs high. Cherry pickers going right to left. Right, left, right, and left. How fast can you go? Crunch it up, keeping those shoulders off the mat. Here we go, it's eight, it's seven. Here we go, it's six, five, four, three. Reverse crunches in two, and one. Lowering the legs down, pressing the toes towards the ceiling, crunch it up. There we go. Lifting your hips off the mat. Slow and controlled on the way up as well, all the way down. Option here to take out that extension long. Extend, pop it up. Really poking the ceiling with those toes. It's eight. It's seven. You've got six. So good for a five. Back to those butterfly crunches in four. In three. Butterfly crunches in two. And one, butterfly crunches. Crunch and low. Option to take out the lift of the legs, keeping your feet planted on the mat, just crunching. Lower backs engage with the mats, like curvature of the spine. Crunch, release. For eight, seven, you've got six, five, it's four, it's three. Around the world in two. In one, around the world. Here we go. Rotate and down. Crunch and lower. Feeling the full rotation. Can you keep your shoulder blades off the mat for eight? Four, seven. Rotate in six. Switch in five. Reverse in four. So good, so good. It's three. Reverse in two. And one, reverse that circle. You are so, so close. Push yourself, do not give up here. Remembering your breath for eight, seven, six, five, cherry pickers in four, in three, cherry pickers in two, and one, legs up the wall. We go right and left, right and left. Here we go, it's eight, seven, six, Here we go, finish strong, finish strong. Last exercise here to the end of this song. You can do this. How many can you fit in? For eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Let that body lay long. So, so good, guys. Inhale through your nose. Exhale out your mouth. The last 55 minutes have been nothing but strength, the body of the mind. I encourage you for these last five to seven minutes to stretch, to find your Shavasana. It's been a pleasure having you guys in class and I cannot wait to see you soon enough in the studio. Wherever you are, take a big inhale, draw that knee towards your chest, right leg in. Circling it around right, circling it around left. Blinking your eyes shut. Inhale, give it a squeeze. Exhale, send it across your body for a cross body stretch. Letting both shoulders stay connected to the mat. Letting your arm come to a T. Letting gravity just take control. Let your mind wander. 
There's nothing to think about, nothing to look at. Removing all the distractions from the world around you. Allow that leg to lift gently off the mat two inches and allow it to sink a little bit closer. Inhale, lift. Exhale, sink. Inhale, draw that knee back towards your chest. Give it a nice squeeze. When you are ready, exchange it long for the other leg. Drawing the left leg in this time. Moving it right, moving it left. When you are ready, inhale, give it a nice squeeze. And exhale, send it across your body, side body stretch. Using this time to come back to that motivation, that encouragement that you set for the beginning of class today. Honoring it and reflecting it, reflecting on it for the next couple minutes here. So having a few moments for yourselves in this world of chaos, it can be good just to let the mind have nothing to worry about besides yourself and what your body needs during this time. Inhale, allow that need to lift. Exhale, allow it to sink. Inhale, lift. Exhale, sink. On your next inhale, draw the knee back towards your chest. Option you to find a happy baby if that feels good. Option to find a figure four, taking a flexed foot across the opposite knee, interlacing your hands between, gently drawing it in towards your chest. Happy babies, maybe you choose to extend one leg and then the other. Maybe you choose to massage out that spine, rocking back side to side. Maybe you choose to stay still and just rock your head, releasing the tension and the energy in your neck. If you are in a figure four stretch, go ahead and find the other side at this time. Just playing around, letting your limbs just lay loose allowing them to just be. Wherever you are, drawing both knees in towards your chest, all exhale, exhale all the air from your body, let it all go. Take a big inhale through your nose, fill up those lungs. Fill up the mouth, fill up the nose a little bit larger, a little bit longer. Hold it at the top, take in a little bit more. And on an exhale, let it all go, laying long. Letting your limbs lay beside you, blinking your eyes shut. Allowing your mind and your body to have no responsibilities for the next few minutes. We are so blessed to have a space that we can come to, to share with one another, to share with ourselves, just knowing the energy moving through our bodies. Having a community to bond with during this time of uncertainty, I encourage you to use it as a platform to build yourselves, to build the positivity in this world. May the four corners of your mat always be a place of comfort, of joy, of determination. You are welcome to lay here for as long as you like. It is, of course, your space and your time. But if you're ready to be guided out, begin to move your toes and your fingers. Gently sending the energy up to your ankles and your elbows. Up through your knees and your shoulders, a slight rock to your head, keeping your eyes shut. Moving up through your hips and your shoulders and eventually your torso to find a seated position at the top of your mat. Exhaling all there from your body, let it go. Take a big inhale through your nose, here's the other. Exhale, let it go. On your next inhale, drawing your hands to heart center. May there be peace in your heart, drawing your hands to your lips, peace in your words, drawing your hands to your third eye, center the space between your brows. 
peace in your mind and your thoughts going forward tonight, this week, and into the rest of this summer. The student life teacher, me on student life teacher, and the student life teacher, and each and every one of you. Thank you so much for sharing your time and your space with me and with yourself. Vow forward, namaste.